Today is Thursday of the first week of the 19th Conference of Parties of uh, here in Warsaw, uh, Poland, and we are well into the negotiation uh, phase of the activities uh, here on various topics. I am going to report back on the topic of loss and damage, which is now well into the negotiations. In the last few days, we have had submissions on this topic from uh, several uh, groups. One group was the European Union, another one from Norway as a country, and the third from the group of G77 in China, which is the developed countries group. Uh, these three have now been tabled. People are looking at them, looking at the different ones and seeing uh, where there are common issues and where there are differences, and there are quite a few differences. They've had informal meetings, bilateral meetings over the course of yesterday, and they will do some more today to try and see whether they can agree on some uh, limited number of agreed parts of the text and then identify the bits which are still uh, not agreed on and then try and negotiate on the disagreements and, and work them out over the next few days. So the next few days, the first week here is going to be very much nitty-gritty, text-driven negotiator level, very arcane language-driven uh, negotiations. Next week, when the ministers come, it will move to the political level. We are hopeful that it should be able to be sorted out at the negotiator's level, but it's unlikely to be able to do that, in which case, uh, when it goes to the political level, the, the political leaders will have to deal with the political aspects of loss and damage. And it is a political issue, which is why it's very likely that the technical people will not be able to resolve everything and we'll have to give it to the polit politicians when they come next week. So we are still hopeful that something will come out, a reasonable set of texts, even if not everything is agreed, uh, that will go into next week, and then at the political level, we will have the heavyweight political bargaining that needs to be done if we're going to get a, an outcome here in, in Warsaw. But I remain optimistic, uh, uh, and I hope that we will be able to get uh, something out of Warsaw, if not an international mechanism on loss and damage, then something very close to that. So I'll report back again uh, early next week. Uh, over the weekend, we will be doing the IIED uh, regular development and climate days, uh, this time with the uh, Red Cross Climate Change Center. Uh, I'll report on that separately as a separate side event that we do. I'll do a vlog on that, but then I'll resume the negotiations.